So real quick, this is just a quick video of what you need to do to disconnect the fiber uh, from the Verizon ONT. Um, you know, it provides everything. Uh, you don't have to disconnect the uh, power, I just did it just in case. <clears throat> so, also this is the Ethernet port here, so if you want to hook up your own router, you could from here and the other end will go to your uh, router wherever it is. Although if you have Fios TV, you need Verizon's router, but for another video. What you need to do here is you're gonna pull this black thing back, like so, and you're gonna see this this um, this cable. I should also let you guys know that uh, if you do, do any damage to this fiber cable or this device from this connector, uh, I've been told Verizon can charge you a couple hundred dollars, if not a thousand, um, to replace it. So I'm just letting you guys know, be very, very careful. Um, they don't really like you guys doing you know, play around with these things, but yeah, we're gonna pull this back. And then you're gonna see this thing, you'll see like this, this little jacket here, and then this cable, and then right there is like a, see it's like a housing, like a little green housing here. See this thing? You're gonna, gonna you're gonna pull it back. Uh, you shouldn't do this one-handed, but yeah. You're gonna pull this connector back, and then you're gonna pull this, back ever so slightly. Not on this, but this piece here. Like so, until it comes out. I can be very, very careful. If it's not doing it, then, uh, then don't force it. Okay. Yeah, also, um, like, <laughs> you could damage the tip of this and you could have bad service, so be very, very careful. Um, don't do what I did, just make sure you're, you know, you're, if it bounces back, you don't want it to hit anything in there, which I kind of just did, but yeah. So I guess one hand will be here, and another hand here, pulling this back. Now, what I mean by pulling it back, you see this the screen piece? See how it goes in and out? So that's what I kind of mean. You're not gonna pull it from here, because you're gonna damage it. But this thing is like an ethernet cable, it's like a clip. So, you know, it's gonna be seated in like this. And you're gonna slide this piece back. And then you're gonna pull the rest of the way from this green piece. Do not pull from here, you're gonna break it. And uh, yeah, again, make sure you're controlling this because this could, as it just did for me, I hope it still works. Um, it could bounce back and damage this or that. Um, but yeah, um, so this is just so you guys know. And then you're gonna put it back. You see this uh, green notch here will be on this side, facing this way. So you're gonna just insert it back like this. And uh, yeah. So I'm gonna try and insert it. Like so, you could just, I don't know the right way of putting it, I would just probably, yeah, put it like so and like this. You're gonna hear it, there you go, clip all the way in. Again, be very, very careful guys, but trust me, this is why Verizon's better because they bring the fiber to the home where everyone else, Comcast Spectrum brings this fiber to the end of the street pole and then they run cable the rest of the way. So let me know if this helps.